All right, so going through a workout at uh, DMV Iron with my boy Diesel. He about to put me through a uh, chest workout. So been knowing him for years. Uh, good to come back, collaborate, get a nice little pump. So again, we're gonna go through some chest workouts. First, to start off with a few flies, and I'm gonna try to touch in on key little concepts, key little tips to make sure that your workout is effective. Again, you wanna make sure you're always going to the gym with a game plan. Stay tuned, watch what we get to. Let's get busy. slow, controlled, you have full access and full control over the equipment and the weight that you move. All right, cool. So uh, let's start with incline bench. And the full incline, emphasizing that upper pecs. Usually you can't go as Heavy as you usually want to when it comes to flat bench, obviously, because you're not recruiting as much muscle, you're not recruiting all levels of that pec. So we're going to really emphasize as much as possible in the upper one rather than our interior delts. So we're going for that angle. This bench is definitely meant to help hit that. We're going to do two warm-ups and then about like three working sets. Let's start with a 40, uh, 35 and then we're going to go up to 50. First 10 reps, do traditional press, and then last five, do a neutral press. There you go. Open wide, every time. Good. Get that blood in that chest. Again, make sure you guys focus on slow control movement. See, he's coming out wide, exploding up. Not banging the weights together. Coming up, explode. Nice controlled movements. By the way, we're just warming up. <laughs> What's the uh, rep count? I'll uh, go for 10. The best way to get heavy weight up, if you're doing any type of incline, benching, put it on your knees, flip it up. Turn it back. Let's go, man. One, two, three. Let's go. Let's go. Ride out, bro. Ride out. Yes, sir. Come on. Stay with it. I got it. Uh huh. Yup. Alright, help me with this. Yup, yup, yup. Yep, yep. Get one more for me. Get one more for me. Try. Alright, stay with it. Over top. Over top. Okay. Nice, bro. Shit. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. That's how you turn up. Let's go. <laughs> Easy. Uh. 
Ah. I'm in. Let's go for a solid 10. Be explosive. Punch off. Good. There you go. There it is. There it is. There you go. Just feel the vibe. Just feel the vibe. Nice, so we got neutral grip, uh, press, flat bench press, we're going to go down exploding, exploding up, uh, not too heavy weight, we just got done doing 115 pound dumbbell incline press, so definitely going for, you know, focusing on uh, chest a little bit more, keeping our movements nice and consistent. Getting swole around here. Trying to get big out here, boy. What y'all doing, man? It's 2019. I ain't playing, man. You gotta be playing. You gonna get big or die trying or get fit or die trying? Really, though. Yeah. Yeah. Nice, bro. Nice. Yep, the light right Here. Uh -huh. I'm here, midway. Oh. So how you count? You count all that as one. So you said one. Yep, that's one. Mm. That's new because I've never done that. You know. I'm taking taking some shit with me now. That's new. You might get I've never done that. Hey, make sure he calls that diesel fly. I got you. <laughs> I, I promise you, I got you. So good. All right, so this exercise here. Uh, we're using cables, we're doing flies, but we're doing a different variation of a fly. So my man right here, pretty much showing you guys what it is, it's called a diesel fly. We go three different positions. We go straight, straight down, straight across, straight up. That's all considered one set. I'm sorry, one rep. So we're doing uh, anywhere from eight to 10, three different variations, lower, uh, middle, upper, it's called the Diesel Fly. Check it out. One, two, three. One, two, three. Go. My shit don't quite look like that. <laughs> hey, we about to get it there, though, right? Gotta <laughs> blow this thing up. There it is. There it is. There you go. Nice. Nice. That's beautiful. Yep. Yep. Get there. Yep. Get there. Yeah. The biggest thing that's what I find it with anything, man, is just like body women is a beautiful thing. Just general fitness is a beautiful right. thing. But there's so many different elements that's still going, bro. Right. Nobody is massive shit. Honestly right. speaking, nobody is massive. Right. Shit. It's, it's too much, too massive. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like we got, we, we don't have, we haven't seen the Jeff Bezos of, of fitness yet. Right. You feel me? So like it's it's still taking its time and just boom, what like five or six years ago. Exactly. You know. So the fact is, that it's gonna take its time, but we still have to find an element of the areas that actually care about fitness. And then DC is making its way, but we're more known for like marathon runners and shit like that. Right. So. For me to be in bodybuilding here and for any other bodybuilder, it's kind of like changing the wave, you know? Right. But people here are still trying to gain muscle. People here right. are trying to get out of that concept of just, oh, I just want to be functionally fit. I just want to be skinny. How about you build some aesthetics? Right. You know what I mean? Because- And I, I think it's, it's, it's explaining that to me. Yeah. Like yeah. they see a certain thing, yeah. they all understand what it is that they're looking at. Right. So like one of the things that I feel I come in at is explaining the natural the female says, Well, I don't want to lose weight, I just want to tone. That's right. the same thing. Baby. And Atlanta is the same thing. Like y'all, y'all getting it too. Y'all getting right. it too. I try to because I touch on so many different platforms. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I'll personally is is bodybuilding. Yeah. But I'm not a stage step on bodybuilding. Same. Same. But I understand and learn the general and the fundamental parts of bodybuilding. Therefore, now I can take that and turn it into programs because I'm gonna show you how to cut and work on certain things or just fucking cut. Right. Or tone or whatever the fuck you wanna call it right. in 2019. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, like, I'm the client as well. I hate doing cardio, so then I'm in class. You know what I'm saying? So I do online training. I mean, I do the uh, 
bodybuilding or training. Mm -hmm. And I do classes, because that's what I like to do. And shit, I burn calories and lose weight or tone, you know what I'm saying, drop body fat doing those, but we have fun. So I kind of take it across so many different stages and avenues that I can have a conversation with you and we can hold that conversation for a long period of time. Or I can talk to Sean T and we can talk about cardio routines all fucking day. You know what I'm saying? Or I can talk to the next trainer or online person because that I, I do so many different things. You know what I'm saying? And that's just the love of the craft. Yeah, you always gotta have the extra plan in bodybuilding. Can't do that shit to kind of stay on top of Mr. Z because there's so many competitors, you know what I mean? That's what happened in Jeremy. I mean, he looked like the best. Yeah. Everything, I mean, even Sadiq, to me, Sadiq, I feel like his body looked better than a lot of them, but on stage, he's got the man. Exactly, yeah. like, you could be a walking billboard all day, you can get a cover all day, but if you're being compared, exactly, you know? Like, bodybuilding, open bodybuilding, it's so hard to do that, that's why not so many people do it, and I don't want to say that Jeremy Wendy was right for saying that men's physique and bikini are taking over bodybuilding, but at the same time, it is hoping it's a market, you know. I mean, that's what even, I like classic physique too, but it's a I love it, that's the one thing I enjoy about it, about the sport, the fact is, is that you know who's down for you, you know who's not. Yeah, very down for you. You grew a lot, man. Props, dude. That's like, funny. I've, yeah. I've seen your growth, you know, through the internet and things of that sort. The growth that I've personally seen, you sustain definition the entire time. Yeah, I mean, even right now, he's lean as fuck. Yeah, smart, man. Health is key when it comes to, like... Like, you can't get injured, nothing. Like, it's so... It's difficult. It's hard, man. I'm going 100% every day. Yeah. You know, but you gotta know what not to go 100%. Very true. That looks beautiful, bro. All right, y'all. So we just got done taking you through one hell of a chest workout. You guys got a new whiff of a, a great exercise called the Diesel Fly. We hit it on three different angles. But make sure you guys go comment. Make sure you subscribe. Tell a friend about everything that we're doing. 2019. Want to take you guys to a totally different level. Now's the time. Make sure you guys comment. Leave me something. If you got any questions, shoot me an email. Shoot me a DM. But make sure you go subscribe comment, it's your boy DT Chef at, we out here.